In Season 3 Reloaded, Infinity Ward have dropped two new weapons into Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2, and they're both pistols. That's right, we have the GS Magna, which is a fully auto deagle, and also the f tac Siege, which is the fastest time to kill weapon currently in Modern Warfare 2 and in Warzone. I'm going to be giving you the technique I use to unlock both of these weapons in just two games, but before we do any of that, I need your help. We're on a mission to become the biggest Call of Duty YouTube channel in the world, and I need your help to get me there. Subscribe right now and help me hit my goal of 1,000 subscribers, and make sure to like the video as well as it helps to get out to more people. First, we need to find out how to unlock these pistols. If you go over to the pistol section and find the FTAC Siege, you'll see that you need 50 hip fire kills with the pistols and with the GS Magna, you'll need to get 30 headshots with the .50 GS, which is the Deagle. Or you can extract both weapons from DMZ, but I'll explain that a little later. I was able to complete both of these challenges in just two games. The way I've done this is I use this Deagle class on screen right now, as it is going to give us easy hip fire kills as every kill with an akimbo attachment gun counts as a hip fire. I also hopped into Shipman as it's a really small map allowing us to get really easy gunfights at close range and the tactic is this. Loading into shipment, you're just going to run around and try to get kills with the akimbo deagles. Don't try to force headshots, try to go for kills and naturally you'll get headshots. What's most likely to happen is you're going to finish the hip fire kill challenge first and then you may be left with a couple more headshots. So you're just going to keep going into games until you finish those challenges. Once you've done that, you'll have both of the guns unlocked. Now earlier I mentioned that you can also unlock the gun through extracting in DMZ. The way it works is either you or one of your friends need to already have the guns unlocked once they do, they drop it to you, you pick it up and extract the gun and that way you will also unlock the gun. So that is a quicker way to do it. Maybe if you have a couple friends, either you unlock it, one of your friends unlock it and then you can give the guns out to everyone and you won't have to do it in a public match. And that is all for today's video people. I hope you guys found it useful. If you did, again, please smash the like button to show your appreciation and get it out to everybody. And if you haven't already guys, please subscribe. And right now I should be streaming Wars and Rank Play right now, grinding to get number one, twitch.tv slash static stunner. Drop me a follow and come watch me live. And I hope you guys have a great day. It's been your boy Stunner and I'm out. Peace. Even when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never ran to the no man, I still go, go, go.